Welcome to my channel. This is a visual video where you will see some cute little stockings. These are for hanging on the Christmas tree. They're very different sizes and shapes. Now the size from here to here is the same, but the foot and the bottom of the foot is a little different, if you'll notice, and across the top. Some have a little ridge here, some are flat, like a little boot. So you can kind of follow this template, but then make the little socks or stockings any way that you want them. You can create them on your own. So we're gonna do a little count. And so that you can see the count, how I did it is I counted one, two, three, four, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So I drew my box first, okay? So you have eleven and then four. Then I know that I have to go in one, one um, square over. So then I'm going to go down. So I knew that once I went over, I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So from here to here is going to be 20. And hopefully y'all can see that. Let me zoom in a little more. Let's see. Let's zoom in. Scoot these out of the way for just a minute. Let's get this one in the camera. Okay. So you have your four. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So you've got your 11. So you're going to trace that. See how I got the line there? So I drew out my little box. Now we just counted to 20, so I know my first square is gonna be 20, so I'm gonna take my marker, and I'm just gonna put a little line right there. And I'm just gonna go down one, down one, and down one. One, two, three, four. So you're gonna go down four. Then once you go down four, you're gonna go across the bottom. You're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So you're gonna go 20, and then you're gonna go one, two, three, four. Then you've got this line here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Now we're going to go up. We're going to go one, two, three, four. Because we went down four. One, two, three, four. So we're going to go up the stairs. One, two, three, four. So once you go up these four, you're going to only do three. One, two, three. That's the little toe part. You're going to go in one, but you're going to go over three. So one, two, three. Because you went up three. One, two, three. You cut this out. Now you're gonna cut that out. Then you're gonna go one, two, three. Then you're gonna take your marker and go up and up to there. So you're gonna have a little two steps. You're gonna go up two steps. One, two. So you're gonna go one, two, three. Then you're gonna skip the space. You're gonna cut that off. One, two, three, go over. Then you're gonna draw a line up on the fourth one and up on the fifth one. So you have a little two step there. Then you're gonna go up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay. So it's either ten or eleven. But you but this one you'll pretty much draw because once you've added these two, you'll just probably pretty much go up the line. And what I've done is I took my, my canvas and I went ahead and pre-cut the size of the stocking so that I could I just did a whole sheet and of course you can see where I just cut this third one out. So let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So you can cut strips of 24 for your stockings. And then I drew my, as you can see here, I drew my four. I went over one, I went all the way down. Then I did over, 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 down, went across, went back up, my one, two, three, four. Now see, this one's three and this one's four. Like I said, my stockings are different. That's why I want you to see. One, two, three, four. Which means I went all the way to this bottom row. So this one's gonna be a little wider, but actually this last row would be cut off to make this stocking. But I wanted to make it a little bit fatter. See how the foot's a little fatter? I think that's this one that I made a little fatter. Yeah, this one. This one I made a little fatter and then I cut the little three step off. And then see here? little fatter and then it has the three step so you have the three step and then without the three steps so I can make the stockings look a little different I don't want them all to be the same so that is your visual video for the day for the stockings that we can go ahead and start making those now because Christmas is right around the corner uh, this is uh, 2020 December 2020 so you may watch this somewhere in January of 2021 but 
you can never start too early on making holiday decorations. And then with each design, let's zoom out. There we go. So you can do stripes, you can do diagonals, you can do the little toe and foot and topping the same. And so it's pretty much whatever you want to do, however you want to design them or whatever way you want to color them. And then what I did is I just ran the string up, tied a knot, went out, came back down, tied a knot there, tied a knot there, and run it through here. So that way it's a little secure. Same with that. And the same with that. I just went through it, came out, tied a knot, went back down to secure it. Then you'll take the little hooks that you have that you use for Christmas to hang your ornaments. You'll attach it to your string and then just hang them up on your tree. Or you can hang them up on your, if you have a wall tree, a lot of people do the, the cut out cardboard and put it on the wall and, and the kids decorate it on the wall, which is really fun. So you can use little thumbtacks if you want to use a little thumbtack to thumbtack them to your tree that's paper designed on the wall, which I wish I would have thought of that when my kids were living at home and or little bitty people. Now they're adults and they live on their own and they have their own trees, but I think it would be fun to do a tree on the wall with some card stock, uh, poster board and some little, you know, ornaments and all kind of stuff. I think it'd be kind of cool. And, um, anyway, so thanks for watching this video. I hope you have a wonderfully blessed day. If you have any comments or concerns, please leave those in the comment section below and we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching.